Hi everyone, this is Hoya Blue Plants and today, it's a Sunday, um, I tend to my plants every day because I have several hundred, um, but today I actually um, have to admit something that I never like to admit, that I do have mealybugs. Um, it is something that happens with a lot of plants and Hoyas, especially Hoyas, that have curly leaves or um, new growth tends to, for some reason, um, in my experience, attract mealybugs, just those tender, beautiful little Hoya leaves. Um, and there's a couple of things that I've tried over the years and the most successful way to get rid of mealybugs, you have to be patient and um, do several applications, is, is isopropyl rubbing alcohol. It does not damage the plant, but the mealybugs absolutely hate it and eventually they just leave. Now I will say if you have a really bad infestation of mealybugs, um, you have to have a talk with yourself. Is the plant really um, able to be saved? Is it potentially bringing in pests to other healthy plants? Um, and I definitely have to admit that I am on the side of uh, taking, not throwing plants away fast enough, but they're part of my Hoya family and I um, spend a lot of time with them and get to know them and energetically feel connected to them. So I really, really hate to give up on a Hoya and throw it away. Um, but sometimes um, you have to do that just because the plant deteriorates so much with uh, the mealybugs. So today what I'm gonna show you is I have a Hoya um, Wayeti. I was like, what is the name of the Hoya Wayeti? Um, this one has uh, really grown nicely. I've had this one probably a couple of years. And um, let me try to find, oh yeah, right here. So again, those mealybugs love to get into curly places and tight spaces. So if you can see on the camera there, uh, they look kind of like white cottony creatures. Um, it's a sticky substance. Um, so what I'm going to do is um, I have just a spray bottle that I um, fill with isopropyl alcohol. I get them at Costco. They, they come in a two-pack. They're super inexpensive. Um, and this may be hard to show. So I'll usually take it in my hand, but I'm just for purposes of illustration and education. Literally, you just spray... And um, you two take your fingers and rub the alcohol in to get into those hidey holes where those mealybugs um, just love to get. Um, and again, it might take a couple of sprays or applications, um, but if you, uh, again, know your Hoya plants and um, look at them routinely, you're gonna see mealybugs. And the first time you see them, get your isopropyl rubbing alcohol and um, just spray, spray, spray. Um, and like I said, I've never seen the alcohol hurt the Hoya plant, but it definitely hurts the mealybugs. Um, so I also will tell you a little bit about the Wayeti Hoya. It is from the Philippines. It takes about three years to um, produce blooms. I have seen blooms on this one, um, but you can see that they, when they're happy, they just grow long, long vines with these slender type leaves. Um, there's a Hoya Shepherdy that a lot of people get confused with the Wayeti. Um, I have a shepherdy that I'll show in another video. Um, but this typically has burgundy or reddish uh, coloring on the outside of the leaves, especially if it's sun-stressed. So it can become quite beautiful with um, those tinges of, uh, like I said, burgundy and purple. I don't know if you can see that here. And then when it does bloom, they are fuzzy uh, little tiny blooms and they range from pink to um, burgundy color and they actually smell like butterscotch. So I hope today's video was helpful in terms of um, admitting, you know, I'm a Hoya professional and I, I do get mealybugs. Um, a great tip that isopropyl rubbing alcohol spray bottle at the first sign, just spray it. It might take a couple applications and just know your plants. Um, if they get too infested, it's probably better to um, definitely take them away from your um, healthy Hoyas. Um, and treat and then occasionally sometimes you will have to um, throw them away get rid of them um, because they get just too stressed with the, the mealy, bug, mealy bug infestation. Thanks so much. Happy Hoya. I appreciate you spending some time with me today.